Hey guys, so we're here at Big Creek. I didn't do an intro because I wanted to make sure the fish are biting first. So I'm using a night crawler. Just letting it sit. I already got one cat. Uh, I'm not fishing for myself, I'm fishing for my dad. That's why I'm keeping them. Other than that, I wouldn't be keeping them because I don't eat catfish. But, we're going to try and get dad a few. Right? Be the nice son. Now, I didn't have the line in the water very long last time. But I wasn't out as far either. So I'm going to bring this in some. Let it sit there. I figure if I can get Dad a dozen of them, he'll be happy. We already got something biting. I didn't get that one. So we're just using a 3 8 ounce split shot with a 5 aught EWG hook. I'm using a Shakespeare telescopic fishing pole. I just, this is going to be my go to for panfish and catfish. Really hoping there's more than just that one swimming around. And bigger ones. That'd be nice. I might even get two pools going. Make my life a lot easier. Okay, before I could finish tying. We got another bite. That's two. Ten more and dad should be happy. Note to self, wet ones are good, but a rag would probably be better. It's a waiting game now. That's how it is with mud cats. It's not a bad one. Give my worm back. Someone's been fighting him. He looks alright. It's three. This is the dirty part, you know. Putting the worm on a hook. Wet ones. Um, yeah. Get 
that back out there. I know pretty much where they're sitting. <clears throat> Got a good current going on too. Now this one, I put a, a hammer hook on, a Guggen hammer, just to see if uh, what's the difference if they work better than EWG. I'm just curious. Like, is the, the hook up better? I haven't used the hammers yet, so. Missed them. I wasn't even going to come fishing today, and then I was like, well, well, maybe. You know, it's like cloud cover. Should be able to get something. And I was right. Cats are biting. After the rain last night, I expected them to be biting. That's a strong weed. Almost perfect right there. Got a nibble already. Look, they're not even touching the hammer hook. Oh. That was a lot of stick. Got another one. That's on the hammer hook. I went ahead and put some water in the bucket. Oh, give me my worm. Just to keep them a little fresher. Alright, so we got a bite here. Hopefully I can get this one. See, the funny thing with catfish, well, mud cats anyway, is they like to pick it up and drop it. Pick it up and drop it. They're like trying to suck the bait off the hook, right? Sometimes it's best just to let them take it. Seems like a nice one. Oh yeah, that's a big bullhead. That's a nice one right there. Gonna have to get more 
worm on that one. That's a nice one. That makes five. That didn't take long. Got it. There, I got another one. So, I think the camera is going to die. So, in case I don't do an outro on this one, catch you next time on Bradshaw's Outdoors. We some mud catfishing.